I was expecting to be surrounded by books. I expected to just be sitting around waiting for somebody to give me help looking for a book. I didn't expect it to be this fun. Hmm. I fixed computers and uh, served people with computer help. And when I first, when I first, when I was expecting when I first came here, I expected to do the same thing at my school. At first, I was expecting um, a little bit of more paperwork. Like I didn't know exactly what it was going to be like. I figured, you know, internship, an office, paperwork, put it together. My department is human resources, and human resources basically deals with hiring, um, hiring support staff, student workers, different type of librarians. I did a database maintenance in the uh, area with Jennifer and um, Rachel. So we uh, basically uh, did like barcodes, replacing the books, like retyping and barcodes. See, my department is the rare books and manuscripts, so they handle the rare books, so like if people call and order for a rare book or a manuscript, and they make boxes for books that are old, that are real old and that are falling apart. What I do in my department, I type up uncatalog manuscripts and uncatalog books. The Weigel Information Commons is a high-tech study space where people have group meetings, you can come here and study, to research, and we also have a digital media there where you can work on your media, such as if you had a project for your professor or teacher, you, this is the place you come to um, do all your artwork and projects and stuff. My department basically does faculty uh, document delivery, which is we deliver any documents from, um, for different professors. So if a professor sends a request by email, what exactly would they need for their classes or their sessions, we look for the article or the books and we either go get them off the shelves, print them out, and then we send them down and um, deliver them to them. I wasn't aware of how books get on the shelves. I just thought they just put on the shelves. But to see all the things behind the scenes that happens in the library was amazing. It's a lot of research into it. They come here so they can use the computer to do research for school, for classes, for pro from print projects. They can take out books, they can take out movies. And as far as libraries are concerned, I never knew that they actually had to go through a whole bunch of other things throughout the day after maybe they sit at the desk and wait for people to come ask them questions. But it's a lot more to it. They do a lot more than just uh, show you where a book is. It's a lot of scanning, and it's a lot of it's a process to getting the books here rather than just knowing just the books just being here. I learned that I respect a lot of librarians now because they do a whole lot of work just to get books into the shelves. <laughs> yes, I have. I enjoyed it a lot, a whole lot. Meeting new people, working, talking to people, doing different things. I really enjoyed it. It gave me a lot of insight on just everything about a library and about other things. I never was really interested in animals and there's a lot of things I found myself opening up and reading. I have enjoyed it and I'm still enjoying it. I would tell them just go for it all. There's a future ahead of you and do your best as you can and just I'll use the library as your opportunity to to better your future. Enjoy yourself. I mean, yes, it's work. You you learn it on a on a professional level, but still enjoy yourself and just be who you are. Don't pass up this opportunity because the opportunities don't come around the corner like this every day. Just be ready to be blown away. Don't be nervous. And come here and have fun and learn a lot. Ten years from now, I always had to say, to me, paper would probably exist only if you're writing. <laughs> electronic. A lot of things are becoming electronic now. So, if you know, we take a lot of books off the shelves and things because they're on the computer now, I would see that a lot of things would be off the shelves and be on the computer. It seems like technology is taking over as far as the computer. Because I remember when I was young, we used to have these little catalogs with all these drawers with little library slot information in it. And I've seen one of those here, but everything else is in the computer.
more more books, more technology, but mostly more technology because technology is growing as we speak right now. I think technology is going to go so far where it won't have to be books. There will probably be CDs or things that people can get more engaged to.